What's good, boys? Got a really fun little blitz for you today out of the Nickel 335i. We're going to show you how to only send two people, get incredible pressure against Bunch, have a great coverage defense behind it, and be able to consistently shed the quarterback if your blitz does get picked up. Now, if you're new to the channel, my name is Cody. We do videos like this every single day to get better at Madden. Madden 23 is right around the corner. This blitzing concept, at least right now, is very effective in Madden 23 as well as Madden 22. And it's out of the nickel 335 odd. I've loved the nickel 335 odd for years in Madden. I think it's always one of the best defenses. I think in Madden 23, it's going to be one of the better defenses in the game. If you want to learn my entire nickel 335 odd defensive ebook, make sure that you join my Patreon. It's only ten dollars to sign up, get you access to all of our ebooks. Got over twenty-five uh, Madden twenty-two offensive and defensive ebooks, and I actually just put an incredible tip in my Patreon uh, this week that is going to really be a pivotal tip for Madden twenty-three. So if you want to sign up for that, you get all the access to all the ebooks, all the updates to all the ebooks, just by joining for just ten bucks. The link is down in the description below if you want to sign up for that. But guys, today we have a really good video um, talking about this blitzing concept. This is a concept, okay? You gotta understand the difference between a blitz, a glitch, a nano, whatever, and a concept. There are concepts that transcend, and this is going to be the loop blitzing concept um, that you can do from several different formations. You can do this from 245 odd, you can do it from dime 236 will, you can do this from nickel 245, nickel double A gap, you can do this from all kinds of different sets. But what we're going to do is we're going to kind of blend two tips. We're going to blend this kind concept with one of the best coverage defenses in Madden 22. So what we're going to do is if you take a look here, we're at our packages. I am in the Baltimore Ravens defense playbook. You can also run this out of New York Giants. But we're going to put the SS inside package in. And what that's going to do is it's going to put a safety right in this position. Now we want to make sure that our best pass rusher on our team is in this position right here. And we want to make sure that our fastest linebacker is right here. From there, you can pretty much do whatever you want. I like to put JPP over here. Um, but again, whatever your roster entails. Now, we also want to make sure in our coaching adjustments that we put auto flip on off. Very important that this is off for this defense. We're going to do this out of Tampa 2. And uh, fairly simple setup, actually. Um, so all we're going to do to set the blitz up is we're going to shift our D-line to the right. We're going to shift our linebackers left and QB contain. Now, from there... This kind of gives us an interesting look that is really um, that is really helpful. Now, I personally really like to press out of this defense, and I really would recommend using this player right here. You want to drag him over the center and blitz him. From there, uh, what we're going to do is we are going to outside third both of our safeties. We're going to middle third that linebacker that's in the middle of the field, just like this. Then what I like to do is bluff blitz this vertical hook. I like to hard flat the defensive end on the right side of the screen. This is going to help a lot with quarterback rollouts. And I like to QB spy the defensive tackle over the center. And what you're going to see is this is a two-man pressure. A lot of times it's going to come in consistently against Bunch. As you see right there, he'll loop around the entire offensive line and get incredible pressure for you. And if you take a look at instant replay, you're going to notice something else that is really important about this. You're going to see here that this tight end wheel is going to be absolutely bagged. Another thing you're going to notice is that we're actually, while this loop is coming in, we're also getting a double team split right here by Shaquille Barrett because of the fact that the game thinks that we're rushing four people. We've talked about this all year long, how important this really is. And as you can also see, this is one of the best coverage defenses in the entire game. we got the vert hook guarding the wheel. We've got this, um, or this vert hook guarding the wheel. We've got this hard flat. If they run, if they roll out, he's also going to help with defense on this running back in route. And then we also have this cloud flat for corner routes. And we have this outside third for verticals, inside third, boom, boom. And basically our user responsibility, we're going to go guard the crosser. As you can see, this is one of the best defenses in Madden uh, 22. And I think it's also going to be one of the best defenses in Madden 23. Let me show you the setup again, really quickly. We're going to shift our line to the left. You could also spread your defensive line if you wanted to, but you're going to shift your line to the left, shift your linebackers, right QB contain. And then what I like to do is very quickly go into my coverage adjustments. I think it's most important to get your coverage adjustments off. Remember we outside third bowl safety to so their corresponding side. We're going to bluff blitz the slot corner. This is going to make the defense think that he's going, or the offensive line thinks that he is blitzing. This allows us to put our QB spy on our nose tackle and our hard flat on this defensive end right here. And as you can see, um, this is just a really, really good blitz. And even if the blitz doesn't come in, we're getting a double team split. It's really hard to roll out on this because we have a spy and we have a hard flat to the side that they're going to want to roll out. Now, let's say that you're playing someone and you're just, for whatever reason, um, they're rolling out on you a lot and you're having trouble stopping the rollout. Then put your curl flats on zero. And the reason you want to do this 
is for whatever reason, the curl flats on zero is very helpful uh, for defending the quarterback rollout. So again, I'm going to go back to the play verticals and you're going to see, we're going to set it up again. And again, after some practice, go into a game and run this defense for the entire game. You're going to notice that you can get the setup down actually really quickly. Uh, but again, you're just going to always use this guy. Boom, boom. And then you're going to vert hook. And then now what you're going to do is you're instead of putting your um, instead of putting your defensive end on a hard flat, you're going to put your defensive end on a purple and a QB spy. And uh, what you're going to see is not only is your blitz going to come in, um, but you're going to see here that we're going to get really good contain logic um, from that purple zone so that when they roll out, we just click the right joystick in and they're going to be rolling out into a quarterback spy and a curl flat defender. So let me just show you kind of how this looks. So at this point right here, they would probably want to roll out of the pocket and go over here to the sideline. The problem is you have this guy right here that is basically a makeshift quarterback spy that is going to be playing right here. This is going to force them to have to check the ball down here. There are some other things that we teach in our uh, in our ebook about how to stop that check down right there. But as you can see, this is incredible pressure um, and it's only sending two people. Thank you for watching the video. If you want to learn the rest of the nickel 335 odd defense, make sure that you join my Patreon. That's where you can get access to all of my Madden offensive and defensive ebooks. Thanks for watching the video. And if if you want to join the Patreon, hit the link down in the description below.